Hannah Gutierrez, the armorer for the movie Rust, was sentenced today in Santa Fe District Court. There were statements made by the family of the victim of the shooting, but the judge who gave Gutierrez the maximum sentence got the last word. News 13's Maryland Upchurch was in the courtroom and has more. Hannah Gutierrez has been behind bars since she was found guilty in March of involuntary manslaughter. Today she found out that she will be spending 18 months in prison. Her jail calls, and there were probably close to 200 of them, tell us who Ms. Gutierrez really is. And in the, in the state's opinion, uh, the content and tone of her calls demonstrates that Ms. Gutierrez should not receive any type of a reduced sentence. The state asked the judge to give Gutierrez 18 months in prison. The shooting happened on Bonanza Creek Ranch in 2021, where Gutierrez was the armorer for the movie Rust. Actor Alec Baldwin was handling a prop gun loaded with a real bullet. Baldwin fired the gun, killing cinematographer Helena Hutchins and injuring the director. Gutierrez's defense asked for a conditional discharge, which would have meant she'd serve no jail time and be put on probation. However, Judge Mary Marlowe Summer agreed with the state. You were the armorer, the one that stood between a safe weapon and a weapon that could kill someone. You alone turned a safe weapon into a lethal weapon. But for you, Miss Hutchins would be alive, a husband would have his partner, and a little boy would have his mother. Please take her. The state brought in a number of witnesses of Hutchins, including her friends and the film's director, Joel Souza. Those close to Hutchins described her as being adventurous, generous, and loving. Attorney Gloria Allred was also in court today, reading and sharing video statements on behalf of Hutchins' family who are in Ukraine. Back to you. Hannah Gutierrez will have to serve 85% of that 18-month sentence. Actor and producer Alec Baldwin's involuntary manslaughter trial is set for July 10th. He has asked for those charges to be dropped. No hearing date has been set on that motion.